Hello everyone, this is Victor Campos, and in this video I'm going to show you how to use Google Plus for your business. In the last video we created a business page which needed to be created through a personal page, a personal account. So here I've got the, um, the Google Plus page. Remember you can switch back and forth by selecting at the top right to go back and forth between accounts. So make sure you're in your Google Plus page and then the screen shows us a variety of things that we can do. Number one that we should do when we create a new account, a business page, is uh, complete the profile. Notice I've got Victor's Bakery, add a unique business introduction. I have no followers, there's my website, enter a 10-word tagline, profile picture, etc. That's what I'm gonna do. Select Edit. If you hover over the profile picture, you can click to, to change that. So you can upload a picture. I don't know if I have anything handy. Um, anything should do. Uh, we'll just borrow this picture here. This is the logo for my uh, company. I've added this picture and it's uh, saying that perhaps also share the picture. Uh, I'm not sure why they do this. I don't think it's very useful, so cancel that. But notice now we've got the customization. Uh, we've got a cover photo here. Uh, so we can change it to something else that's built in, or we can upload our own picture. I'm going to select to simply change a picture that's, that comes built in. That's nice. If I want to change the name of my company, actually, I can click to edit the name and I can change it. We have a variety of other things that we should change. For example, there's a section of story. I'm going to change these items, so select edit. I get this screen here. And actually, these are a variety of things I can change. I want to change them all, but for the moment, it's the story. Tagline, 10 words that describe your page the best. Let's see, I'm going to say uh, San Diego's premier. This doesn't have spell check, so be careful. San Diego's premier uh, bakery since 2001. Introduction. Put a little about your page so people know what that they found the correct Victor's Bakery, because there might be others with a similar name. Let's see, we can say founded in 2001, Victor's Bakery strives to serve the best quality baked goods with a friendly demeanor and great prices. Use this space to really stand out from the competition. Save. And now my story's filled out. I've got links here that I can edit, that I should edit. Website, definitely. I can add more links, such as, well, I've also got a Facebook. Add that in. And I have uh, a variety I can add just so that everything's linked together. Save. And I'm building my profile. 
contact information. This is always good for a business, so we have a variety of options. Phone number, mobile, email, etc. Let's say I want people to email me. And I want them to call me. And, uh, and uh, visit me also. So I've got the contact info filled out. And then we've got a section of people, which doesn't make sense at the moment, so we'll get back to it. But this is what my current profile looks like to people. And uh, I'm on my way. Uh, I want to look professional, so I want to make sure to fill all of this stuff out. That's what we did in this video. There's still plenty more to do, so come back on the following videos and we'll keep adding to and learning about our Google Plus profile.